Alright, so in today's video, I'm going to talk about the banana plugs. You can see here uh, four of the banana plugs, and uh, these are used as the speaker connector. For those who don't know that yet, uh, to this day, all the branded uh, amplifiers, power amplifiers, and every receivers uh, comes with the banana plug socket, and also that has a binding post. Let me show you that one. Uh, these are, you can see, you can use them as a binding post too. See, here is the gap. You can put the wire inside it and tighten this knob. And you're done. That's your binding post. You can use this as a binding post. And for a better result, use a banana plug just like this and it push it in that's it so uh, there are many types of banana plugs you can find in the market and these are one uh, you need to slide the wire from here inside and then tighten this screw and your connection will be ready And another one is here. You can see there. Let me focus on that. There it is. And in this case, you need to shoulder the wire to to this pin, just like this. Oh, the shouldering here is not so good because it's temporary. I'm going to change the wire. I'm going to use the thicker wire later. So, so this is uh, one type, and uh, these are another type of uh, banana plugs. And uh, instead of using uh, the binding post, better use the banana plugs because the connection will be proper. And you can remove it easily and plug it in whenever you need to replace or move the receiver or to clean it whatever it is so that's it and uh, this is the entry level receiver that's why uh, the only front channels left and right uh, having the banana plugs and rest of the center surround and also it has a subwoofer uh, they all have the push type connectors but but all the high level receivers, all the uh, speakers are having a uh, this type of connectors. So for that, you can use all the banana plugs for all the speakers connection. And that will be uh, proper connected and also you'll get better result from that. And uh, you can plug it and remove it whenever you need to do so this is it guys and uh, let me plug this one and the socket comes with the cover uh, here you can see this holes this holes uh, stays covered up with a uh, plastic tip you need to remove that tip then you can use the banana plugs and uh, let me show you that here it is and uh, another one that's it and whenever you need to remove just this you're done so uh, this was a simple video about the banana plugs and uh, the uses of it uh, hope you guys like the video. Thanks for watching.
Bye-bye.